Hello, not Tinkerbell. Hey, yeah. Do, do, do you remember, is Tinkerbell still like a big sassy slut? Is that still that thing where it's just Whoa. like... No, Are you like slut shaving fictional characters. No, they 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 like Tinkerbell went from being in the movie to having like these t shirts where she's just like, I don't do Mondays with like a sassy look oh. on her face. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, look, it's a dragon. It, what, why is it all <laughs> choppy? I don't know. What's happening? It's literally the first part. Oh. Now, yep. She's intimidating. Yeah, we're back to Dragon's Crown, Dragon's Crown Pro here what? in the dojo. You remember when we played this? Uh, yeah, Six years yeah. ago? God, how could I forget? I mean, like, if you are if if you can't remember, your memory is about to be chogged here in a minute or two. Uh, I recall. Wow, his muscles have muscles. Yep, he's got muscles on muscles. But he's a dwarf. Yep. Okay, here's your typical evil wizard, your Raceland. Yep, a Hot Topic uh, employee. Yep. And there they are. Why was she holding that skull between them? That's where you keep skulls, okay. right? <laughs> I know women who have like three or four in their uh, prodigious cleavage. Really? Oh, yeah. Really? Okay. Yeah. Uh, Lots of skulls in there. By the way, hi, everybody. I'm Jeff. I'm Jason. Yeah. And uh, yeah, Dragon's Crown Pro. I, I have vague recollections of this. I think this game is is really fun. You uh, handed me a controller, so I guess that means we're both playing right now. I pre I'm pretty sure. I oh. wonder if... Disney's just cool with Tinkerbell's presence in this. Oh, They're yeah. They're like, yeah, sure. This looks like something we can yeah, get behind. Like one of those things like, <laughs> you don't own fairies. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Back yes. it up. Okay. Shit. Jeff, wait. you ruined it. Wait, wait, I couldn't on. read what the... Okay, there we go. Yeah. What does this say? Are, are they a... Dragons. Are, are they a death metal Crown band? Pro. But I can't, I can't read the fucking name. You can't see the D... R A G O N. Okay, I can kind of make it out, but okay. it's about as legible to me as a game tag. <laughs> it looks like, it's like my wife has these metal bands that she listens to, and she's like, "Oh, check this one out." And I'm like, "It's just like it looks like someone's carved random slashes into a tree." <laughs> and apparently, that's a thing with death metal bands: is you try to obscure the name. Yeah. And I'm wondering if Dragon's Crown is trying to do that. I don't like, think the Dragon's Crown is trying to be metal. Like we're we're I in, think it's just bad graphics. We're, we're so. in an inn. Like <laughs> I don't okay. I, I don't see anything here that's uh, maybe they're there. Ooh, to there see. you go. Hit the options button. Hit the options button. There you okay. go. All right. So I'm gonna make a character. One of us has to be the giant, the giant boob lady. Sure. Uh, do you want to be the giant boob lady? I'll do it. Yeah, I don't care. Okay, I think I was last time, so I'll be. Uh, Let's go. How about how about if I'm this this giant lady? God, she's be the other terrifying. Platinum blonde, Felita. Yep, honey, okay. honey, honey blonde, blonde. Lilac, lilac blonde. They're all blondes. Okay, I don't care. Uh, it's fine. All right, so now it's your turn. I don't want to objectify her, but oh, those are some muscular friggin' legs. <laughs> it's like she could probably like crush beer cans with her ass. This I is still you. No, that's you. Left, that's left stick. Are you yeah, doing left stick? I'm doing left stick. Oh, oh. wait, that's is that you? No, that's me. Okay. What? Hold on, hold on. What's happening? I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Cutting this out. Uh, weird. Yeah. I always just assume it's me. <laughs> it's like, it's probably my fault. I probably broke it. Things around the house, things in my job, something's broken. I'm like, yeah, that's, I probably did that. I don't remember doing it, but I probably did it. Oh, that's very strange. Oh. All right. All right. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll cut what all that out. What happened? Uh, I have no idea. Okay. Uh, I have no idea. So there you go. Okay, Grace. Yep, that's cool. Sure. Uh, Silky black. Uh, deep, deep crow. Deep crow. <laughs> like, what is her? Are her? Is her pelvis broken? Like, look at her legs. The tilt of her legs in comparison to like her upper body. I think she's got like bad superhero uh, uh, posture. Deep crow crescent knight. Uh huh. Dark blue, yep. wine, scarlet. These are all colors that I am completely unfamiliar with. <laughs> it looks like black to me, so I'm going to go with that. Okay. English, Japanese. We're going Japanese. All right, great. Okay. Uh, so you never it. actually like played that. So yeah, then pick her. <laughs> uh, no, no. I played you it with you yourselves. here yep. or on the previous name. incarnation. I think it was at your oh, no. house in Danny. Round Rock. Yeah, it was a load <laughs> it was loading bar. Yeah, yeah. Quaffing the bar's spirits, Boyd, your spirits. 
When things I like, late, you know, I find it strange that Vanillaware is like the only company that does this kind of like super high res 2D thing, where it's like it, it's literally kind of like a like the 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 idea of a sprite, but if you like really if you painted it in like 4K or whatever. Uh, uh okay. Oh, I am. This is starting Wait, to come are you, back to me. Oh, I don't think you get to be a thing. Why is it's like square? Why are her buttocks like squares? Yeah, those They're are some square. Did she work out so hard that her buttocks are now squares? Uh, Jeez. Okay, and evade. All right. This Success. is Rob Liefeld would look at this and go, <laughs> "What?" So maybe ease up a little bit. Ease <laughs> up a little bit. Yeah. Uh, okay. Like, oh, that's cool though. It's stylized. It's weird. It's not really my thing. But, yeah. Uh, you know. So here's the thing. I've yeah. come around on Rob Liefeld. Oh, have you? I don't think he's like every. You know, there's this still this joke on the internet. Rob Liefeld, worst comic book artist ever. Yeah. I think that's absurd, because it's not realistic. Yeah. So what? So what? Um, you don't get photo real in comics. It's just a style. It's an art style, like Klimt. <laughs> okay. You're not. No, no. Wait, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Are you as somebody who it's went to little, art school? It's a little provocative. Uh, comparing Rob Liefeld to Gustav Klimt is a little like that. I I don't know that I can really. Do, so I well, know in college you had a, a poster of the kiss. My problem on your wall. I, I, I was. You have one here in Rage Select Studios. Yes. Uh, uh, I actually see. I my the thing that irritates me about Rob Liefeld is that there are parts of his drawing style that are um, that are not bad. They're lazy. Oh. So like okay. the fact that he cuts off the feet is because. It's hard to draw feet, and he's fucking lazy. Has he ever admitted to that? Uh, not that I know of, but like, there's no good reason to draw everything but the feet all the, t but except for the feet the entire time, or like the uh, Liefeld's disease where the eyes are always little slits. Like, draw eyes, Rob. That's like a style. It, it, okay, well then it's a bad. Then we can we can still say it's a bad style. <laughs> that it's a a poor looking style. It doesn't bother me anymore. Okay. Yeah. Well, you I know. used to. I I don't know. I jumped on the bandwagon. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, whatever. It's okay. The yeah. It's a style. I mean, okay. May may maybe he does it out of laziness. Uh, who's 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 to say? I guess you, as yeah. an artist, sure. would know more than me. <laughs> I do not. I'm I am not an artist myself. I have to label things when I draw them. Yeah. So that people know what I'm drawing. <laughs> <laughs> um, what is that? What is that? A, a, a candle? <laughs> yeah. Twinkie? Yep. JFK? Um, well, this is delightful. Yeah. <laughs> I will be getting to it. I think we'll be getting to it in just a second here. Yeah, I... Um, no, I... The, the thing is that I do understand, like, I, I have gotten to the point where there are things that... Like, everybody was so goddamn fired up about Ready Player One, one way or the other, Jason. And yeah. I was just like... I could care less. I could care less either way. I don't I don't hate it and I don't love it. I think it's a mediocre book that's got some good ideas. Uh, and I watched the movie and I found it largely inoffensive and, and kind of just forgettable. And so I'm not mad and I'm not ecstatic and I'm not just like, well, I am once again finding myself at a phase in life where I just don't care. <laughs> Yeah, you know, the thing is that uh, somehow I've managed to uh, join you there. Uh, just like, <laughs> you know Welcome. what? Welcome. Did you not like The Last Jedi? All right, fucking go for it, yeah, man. Yeah, like, okay. Will you make a 25-hour explainer adventure. about why The Last Jedi is a fellows, betrayal to all Star Wars fans? Yeah. So that's I, cool. think, I think you might be the problem. I'm not going like, to. Are you starting a petition <laughs> about a movie <laughs> or a comic book or a cartoon? Yeah. Then uh, currently I have to something. I would like to take you to dinner at the hardware uh -oh. store, and Learn where we skill. will sup upon, where you will sup upon a whole bunch of lie, <laughs> a whole bunch of Drano. Okay, you're just gonna drink that shit if you have started a petition about a movie. Now, see, that still sounds like you care about something, Jason. Oh, well, I guess it still I do. sounds like you want to hurt the guy who's complaining. I'm just like, uh, nah, that's all right. I. Uh, yeah, you're, that's, that's a good point. The Last Jedi, I think, was the breaking point for me, where I was just like, you know what? Like, 
You know how people had said, like, oh, man, after the prequels, I don't even like Star Wars anymore. Like, they broke me. Yeah, Brian Brushwood. Yeah, they actually did that to me to where I'm like, I don't know, Episode 7 seems like it was okay. I saw it twice in the theater. It's a fine movie. Watched The Last Jedi. Liked it. Didn't see what all the fucking... Just yeah. screaming and Destroyed yelling. Destroyed my childhood and violated everything. It's like, okay, don't watch it. Then. Yeah, don't watch it again. And I'm, I'm currently doing that. We just this weekend had the. Uh, by the way, do you know what X uh, square button is like? Attack, right? And then you're you can, like, hitting me. Hold it down. I don't think I can. Hold on, hold on. Let's do it. Yeah, experiment. no, you're taking. I'm taking. No, you're not. See. It certainly seems like I was taking damage. You got 300 hit points. You got 300 hit points. Oh, okay. Um, but well, yeah, still, X button don't jumps. Do that. If you hold down the square button, you'll run, which is the funniest thing in the world to the sorceress. What just happened? I think you like powered up or something. You hold down the square button, you There run? you go. Whoa, lady, whoa. That's ridiculous. <laughs> whoa, hold on, hold on. Wait, we got to go this way. <laughs> oh, um, yeah, this is... We're going this into is, this game is weird. Morgan's magic shop. Whoa! Why are we are we kneeling? Is Morgan gigantic? Is she like Supreme Leader Snoke? Where is this game developed? Is this Japanese? Of course this is Japanese, dude. Look at the size of these knockers. Of course it's from Japan. Ornate magic staves. And is she holding a piece of someone's fence? I, it certainly looks that way. Okay, so we have to repair our equipment. Yep. Wait, is your sh your shit's already wrecked? It's part of the tutorial. Not only for repairs, but for appraisals and to purchase magic items. Also to stare and you gawk and go hamana hamana hamana. <laughs> um, I like the guy's voice. It sounds like pushing daisies. <laughs> the pie maker traveled around with the extraordinarily disproportionate people. Sorry, that was a little bit of a deep cut. Whoa, wait, whoa, whoa. Okay, wait, hold on for a second here, Jason. Yeah? I got I to gotta ask an ass question real fast. <laughs> so see how our ass is you like... You come to the right guy. Okay, you see how our ass, uh, my character's ass is like... It's got it's pointy, right? It's, it's like triangles. Yeah, it's, it's like uh, little squares. It's like there's some strange non-Euclidean geometry. It's supposed to be super buff, I assume. I think I think. But I then think. when she jumps, it turns like it's like two oranges. Like whoop! Like see, it just turns into melons yeah. next to each other. That it's is... almost like they inflate. Like in case of water landing, the Amazon's buttocks will inflate and. Uh, yeah. She's she has some some enhancements going on. Okay. It's a land of magic, you nerds! <laughs> it is. She's magic ass. Uh, his head's really tiny. Yep. I mean, I can't shame anyone for the size of their heads. Mine is slightly larger than normal. Yeah. But his is, it's, it's wee. What up, small head? What do you think you're doing? What will you do? Oh, okay. Should we state that you're overqualified for this test? Your adventure guild bullshit. Yeah, I don't need any. We played nonsense. this game like Small ten years ago. <laughs> yeah, we got the ass. Are the truest hallmark of the worthy. Well, give me a deed, you wang. Okay, great. And who's this? Is this like our? I, I, I think you went back in there. The guild I don't yeah. care. Yeah. How do I leave? Now, what will you do? After hearing your reply. Samuel states that Good. now you've told him yeah. that he's a dick as well. Yeah, so you're a dick, sir. Yeah. It's now unmarred. You should return to the. Oh, it won't let us continue until we say. Please Once tell me again, what to do. You fuck. Watch. Fine, there. Samuel. Okay, or so Roland, whoever you are. Um. All right. So now we're gonna go hit the touchpad. Go to the gate. To prove your metal for yeah. the guildmaster. Just do the thing. Head to the ancient temple eh, ruins eh, eh, to eh. assist the warrior. Okay, how how much of the the was the previous one did you play? On the um, so the previous it one had like it, it it was like a two it was like a two part deal. Like the first part was that you went through all these levels one time and you fought a bunch of bosses and it was fun. Then you needed to go through the entire game kind of a second time, uh, with other people the same levels but harder challenges. And that, I think, was where I stopped. Okay. But I think that you actually, you technically, you beat the game. Yeah. And then you can keep playing it, like, to get better gear sure. with friends and stuff like New that. New Game Plus? Or? Yeah, uh, more like it just continues going. Okay. Like, after the boss. Many things lie within the so, one thing, uh, I don't know if you remember this, is if you, you write button moves your cursor around, and um, there's just like, oh, shit. Spoken of in myths. Is said to have destroyed there you go. Civilization. I think there's just like night. stuff around here. Yeah, okay. Oh, shit. You liberated a fairy. 
that was trapped in a cage. Great. Uh, okay, hold on. We gotta get this. Let this asshole unlock this thing. Um. Uh, yeah. Yeah. The the current thing is uh, the Dark Souls remaster. The current thing that uh, all, all my gaming peeps are are just shittily pissed off about. Why, why is everybody mad about the Dark Souls remaster? Um, it, it, look, it, they kind of have a point. It's that... Oh, that's your, like, how hard your magic is going to hit. Yeah? I think. Um, is that they, they haven't done a lot of work on it. Like, you people have, have expected that. Whoa, Roland. Conan! <laughs> Damn. Look at the... Roland. Roland. I'm not Conan. I am Roland. Look at it. Look what he... When he breathes in, he, like, flexes. And it looks like he's got some some... Some marbling on his I think pecs. I think he's flexing his hair. <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that. Look at his trip. No, check out his belt buckle. Holy That's awesome. Holy shit. What the hell is happening with that? Also, That's the best part. And I think we're. Uh, did he did he fuck those orcs to death? I, like that one guy doesn't have pants on. Look, his ass is hanging out. Oh, my God. Did Roland fuck those orcs all the way to death? <laughs> okay. For you Don't to fuck with Roland. Yeah. Exactly. Noted. You must help him. Help him? What? How could we help him? I think he's handling it pretty well here. Oh, he just doesn't want to. He we can he help him because he just doesn't want to do the thing. <laughs> yeah, help me do this because I need a cigarette. That's right. I gotta talk to Crom for a few minutes. Um. Um. Uh, yeah, people wanted them to go back in and do a much more, a much bigger like remaster. Yeah, and like remake. Uh, the thing is that, you know, there have been a half dozen... Oh, I can do that. Oh, can you go take us in here? The, there's been a half dozen, you know, like the Shadow of the Colossus remake. Uh, yeah. And places where they've actually gone in and kind of, like, remade the whole game instead of just kind of up it, doing some minor improvements and then putting it out. And especially the... It, it's... Like, I, I really try not to be a, a real shitbag about this, but, like, the PC people who have had access to, like, mods and fan patches and things oh, like yeah, that yeah. are like, well, why should we even buy this? We already have the mods to make this. It's like when the Skyrim Enhanced oh, yeah, Edition came yeah. out, and they were like, well, we've already have five to ten years worth of awesome mods for this. Why would anybody want this? And it's like, well, not everybody has a computer. It's not really for you, man, as much as it is for other people. Yeah. And, like, there's a lot of shit in the PV PvP of Dark Souls Remastered that's still broken. And so, yeah, it mostly seems like it's the PC people that are upset because... Um, what? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Jason, get it. Use your magic. <laughs> Shoot it with... No, go up there and hug it to no. death. No, where's that crossbow? Get Pick it back up. Ah, uh, ah, uh, gross. Give it some hugs, Jeff. I was going to buy... I was going to play Skyrim. Speaking of... I was going to play Skyrim VR, uh, and then I remember that when you start the game, you have to go into that cavern where the spiders are, and I was just like, nah, nah. Nah, that's okay. It's okay. I don't <laughs> I don't want to be looking down the business end of one of those motherfuckers. So what does that what does that do? What are you know. doing? I don't know. It's like charging something up. Okay. I figure it's better to have it at three hundred than less than that. So okay. I just hold down square and the number gets higher. Higher. Whoa. It has something to do with with this whole thing. Okay. Which is oh, it's pretty like, much my move right now. You have to can you like hold that button down? Like you know you can like shoot in the air and if you hit like up or down it changes what your attack is. Oh uh, nope. Wrong. Oh, up, that wrong. was good. Yeah. That was great. So Hit hold, hold up and then hit your attack button, and it'll probably do something slightly different. And then oh, cool! Down yeah, does something slightly different. So, yeah, there we go. Oh, look, there's the thing. Whoop! Yeah. God damn it! Um, I don't know. You know, it's strange to me that this concept has not really. That nobody. I, I was trying to think today while I was look while I was downloading this, like who else has done this shit? Because this is like uh, what Shadows of Mistara or whatever the yeah yeah like the D and D the whole D and D is kind of like an a, like a, a an elaborate like golden axe right yeah, yeah, like, yeah Shadows it, of Mistara or whatever uh, what was the other one uh, Tower of something Tower yeah of but it, but it has like a whole like leveling up getting more skills getting equipment from bosses like getting better equipment and buffing and things like that. And so, like, why does nobody, because, like, last week, uh, uh, 
fucking Matt Frank and I played this game called Raging Justice that was like an 80s cop kind of brawler Streets of Rage type of thing. Nice. Uh, which was fun. But this, like, where, why, where could I get more of this? Like, this seems like only this game does this. And I don't know. Um, with the amount of garbage that's on Steam these days, you'd figure that somebody well, would The amount of something. nostalgia, you know? Yeah. Um, the amount of nostalgia, and it's like... Oh, so wait, hold on. Just hold... Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> what? It's like 90% bird, and then like just 10% sick boobage. Uh, <laughs> argh, motherfucker, Mark. Dude, don't let it oh. scratch you in the face. Just scratch your fucking eyes out. Oh, see, you, you do have a dodge move, you do know, right? The Didn't R, know that. R1 button makes you dodge. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I haven't even messed with the, the triggers at all. Have you have you done anything but jam on that one button over and yes. over again? Yes, I have. I've jammed on two buttons okay, good. over and over. <laughs> it's back. Rah, motherfucker. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, that was bad. Yeah. It's all right. I've been I've been bogarting all of the health power-ups in this level, so ah! I've got a pretty fair amount of health have at you? this moment. Yeah. I've got like 200 and I've got an apple that I can eat if I need to. You also have um uh, some health juices if you want to use that. How do I use those? Uh use the D-pad to select the one that you want. Uh you should have a health potion up there and then hit down the next one over and hit down to use it and you'll get health back. Oh, helpful. Yes. Yeah. Sorry, I realized that I actually <laughs> played the tutorial earlier. I should have let you play the tutorial. Yeah, I didn't have any idea what the hell was going on. <laughs> I was like, I have potions? Yeah. I didn't know I was carrying things. I guess it's between my cleavage with the skulls. Yep. Similar to this one spread throughout the area. You All right. The area, taking care to avoid drawing the attention. I kind of want to see. Armies. It's weird that I kind of want to see this. This I think also has 4K support, if I'm not mistaken. Really? So you could see that that guy's freakishly oversized hands. Yep. Not, not her, but the her freakish huge tracts of land. Um, you leveled up. Whoop. Okay. There's a lot to like about this. I. You know, it's. I agree. I think you have to hit the hit the I button. I did. Yeah. Okay. So then here we get our spoils, uh, but this is kind of Diablo style where you've got to like identify in order to use Runka. stuff. Runka, Vulj. Uh, wait, That's oh, great. Yeah. I don't know what any of these things are. What's a Runka? It's What's a, a Vulj? I know a lot about medieval weapons, like maybe more so than most people. Yeah. But not as much as people who know things about medieval weapons. Uh, I wait, don't know what a Vulj is. Any equipment? You just took it all. That's okay. I'm generous. I, wait, I have on. everything I need. Okay. Well, I, I assume it was giving me different equipment than you because you can't use the big axes. Yeah. So. That's true. Uh, you know, like. Oh, I guess it's. Let's see, one to oh, seven. Now, is that its proper name or is a runka? No, that's its proper name. That's got to be. What are you on about? No, the Runka and Volge and all of the... What the hell are those things? I would assume they're classifications for... I think Volge is a type of weapon, right? I've never heard of it. I've heard of Polaxe. Okay. Uh, here, why don't you check and see, do you have any equipment? Check, hit that again. That's so strange. Why did it not give you anything? Maybe... Oh, maybe when the... Maybe you just took it all, you jerk. Well, that's... So E is equipped, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Nope. All right. That's it. Okay. Well, let's... Yeah, I don't care. It's fine. I got this. I don't uh, need it. Here. You can have all the fancy weapons. I will no. take them all with what I started you, with. You will need those. I'm gonna later. do. <laughs> I'm gonna do one of. The, I'm gonna do one of those like crazy feats that you see on like Dark Souls or Bloodborne, where they're like, I fought all the way through just punching. Yep. Do you see those playthroughs? Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, hey, I read an article about a, a Super Metroid playthrough the other day. Uh -huh. and they did it in like 40 minutes or something. Yep. Yeah. That's yeah. about. I've watched a few of those. Yeah. You took a little bit longer. But not. I mean, not that much. It's a little bit. Like 42 minutes. So. 
something like uh, that. Yeah. The prayer of the monks sometimes <laughs> all right, all right, man. I think that I think this entire world might have a bad case of tiny headitis. Like, like yeah, or like acromelagy, where they're just. I think also are... is he just wearing like a the thing at the front of the church, like is, it's is, got is little it doors like, on it. Like stuff? A, what is it, what is that? It's like a. It's like a little. Is, is, this, is he like the monk version of the 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 dude that wears the clock around his neck? Flavor Flav. Flavor Flav. Yeah, is that what's happening here? I, I don't know. He's the monk version of Flavor Flav, obviously. Yeah. All right. So we're bringing this motherfucker back to life. Quench their thirst. Is that how that works? I, apparently, you little naked babies come down from heaven, oh, put a bird on you. This is trippy. Then boom. And awaken them. So when you're playing single player. You basically find it's these like a Van Halen album. <laughs> you find the bones in the uh, in the dungeons, and yeah. then you can make them into AI dudes that will help you, so you don't have to deal with jerk offs online. Oh, rad! Uh, that's that's very cool. Yeah. Anything that helps me avoid jerk offs online. If you know what I mean. Oh. Great, we'll take that dog. <laughs> that dog does not look like he's ready for an adventure. That's true. He looks like he's ready for snugs. Yeah. During your questing, be sure to bring them back and resurrect them. Okay, well, let's see. Let's uh, choose allies. He's, look at that asshole over there in the corner. The, the right? Yeah. He's, he's that jerk who just kind of sits there at the party and just kind of plays guitar. We're uh, hoping that someone will come talk to him and ask him about, uh, ask him to play a guitar, and then he plays like. What? what? Then he plays. Nope. I, no, did I, I do that? I yeah. I did? Yep. Check. Let's get out of here. Oh, good. This is real. Nope. Don't pray to the disembodied tit goddess. Why not? Well, you, you don't don't be a heathen. Okay, sure. I mean, every time you do it, it costs more. Wait, like, it costs you get a, money? You get a, yeah, you get a bonus. It costs money to pray. Yeah. Oh. I mean, you can pray for free, but if you want something from the tit goddess, then <laughs> pony up, <laughs> those motherfucker. Are, those like are words you said. <laughs> oh, shut up. I don't care anymore. Yeah, I don't want any of this. Just fuck off. <laughs> Okay, let's see if we can get one more adventure in here. Who's this guy? That's Is that the, the dwarf? That's the guy that we resurrected. Yeah, that's the dwarf. Uh, He's weird looking. Yeah. This is a creepy little bugger. After okay. delivering your report, you think you see part of a smile. Great. Now that's good. Okay. Excellent. Great. The Adventurous Guild has a backlog of quests. Great. Samuel never smiles. You left to find the dragon's crown. Great. The existence of this crown. Man, sure. why does a dragon need a crown? A nope. No, is nope. anybody asking that? Nope. That it's, it just alive. said, it the game literally, the as you asked that question, just said, minister. the king was looking the for the crown that was said it could control dragons with its blah, blah, blah magic. <laughs> oh, so, I tuned out. <laughs> yeah, you were. That was you, at the moment where I was like, okay, words, I'm done. Yep. And, but, yeah. Okay, so let's, uh, let's learn some skills here. Uh, stun wave, div diving attack. Sure, I'll give me that stun wave. How many skill points do I have? How about Ripple Butt? That's. <laughs> uh, let's do this one too. It gives you health when you pick up Cashola. So, do you get it? Can you do anything? I don't, I don't know. know. Okay. You have a request. Help the honey buzzards. Okay. The honey buzzards. Yeah, the wasp population. I don't. I don't truck with. Is wasps. that what they call wasps in this? Honey world? buzzards. Honey buzzards. You accepted a new request Man. from the guild. Fuck wasps. Go to the castle for further details. Yeah, I mean, I guess I'm more of a fuck fire ants guy. Ooh, uh, yeah. Wasps, the, they... Whoa, okay. I, this guy seems like he's got really good intentions. He seems like a real stand-up guy who doesn't at all... He, he looks like he has difficulty breathing. <laughs> Yeah, and uh, that he, that, that like, he's one of those guys that smells like ham, uh -huh. and like spittle collects in the corners of his mouth when he talks. Even though he hasn't had any ham in a long time. He has not had any ham. Oh, okay. The royal ham has been stolen. A witness who saw the thief described him as a ham thief. He's a ham bandit. He's a ham dit. No. Tom, it took my fucking ham. <laughs> okay. Return to me the ham. I will okay. store it within my and beard. All right, we gotta go get a. We gotta go get the royal ham from. The royal scepter, my God, this game is. This is why I said we didn't need to know this shit. This video is game. Pretty talky. Okay, let's see. Map, 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 oh, map, map, I was just map, jumping map. up to attack that dude. He was coming at us with a threateningly with a basket of basket, <laughs> a basket of apples, a basket of baskets, a basket of baskets. That's how you know he's crazy. He's the basket. Hold down the square button. You can run. That's your. Yeah. Yep. 
It's right. just so silly. Let's I just can't. jump in here and then we'll take a, a quick break. Highland. We. There's a, it's, yeah. I, it's very pretty. It's very, it, very it pretty. Is, it's, it's very stylized. It's pretty. There's mm -hmm. a lot to like. There's also, uh, like, later on, you get to a point where you're, you're eating, like, food These before you start up to, like, power up. And uh, sure. the thing I was trying to tell you is if you use the right Following stick and just kind of move it around, you can find, empire. like, little now treasures out in the world. Who has, who has time for that? Uh, well, I found a skull. Good. Great. But guess what? What? I got one in my boots. Oh, shit. Whoa. I thought you were going to say your head. Uh, oh, great. Wouldn't that be weird if uh, there was like some genetic mutation where some people had... Uh, boob skulls? Yeah, they had skulls in their boobs. Yeah. Man, that would be a little strange. Whoa. That's going to be uh, my, oh. my next screenplay. <laughs> <laughs> it's called Boob Skull. Yeah, Boob Skull 2. Return to Skull Boob Island. There's probably some deviant art or something out there that... <laughs> than already. Uh, yeah, there's probably some deviant art out there for everything. Pretty right? much. I, mean, I, I I bet that is so. I, one day I found a video online that was talking about the Sonic the Hedgehog fan art community. Man, of, people are weird about Sonic, dude. They, they 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 really are. I don't it, I don't really don't understand it, but and they they understand like. The differences, but like the philosophical differences between Knuckles and Sonic, and like I've gone down some really weird rabbit holes in the internet. Is this like, is this for the next Modern Rogue? The Modern yeah. Rogue explains what the fuck is <laughs> the Sonic. Modern Rogue. <laughs> it's just a Sonic, it's just you explaining Sonic the Hedgehog to Brian Brushwood for like an hour and a half. <laughs> it's, it's the longest he, Modern he, Rogue of all time. He would be completely <laughs> unsurprised. He's like, oh, Jason's going just on and on again about something I don't give a shit about. It is said that whatever what, this man do he, does, he want five. Is that what he's doing there? <laughs> he's like, give, me, give me five. Give, give, give me some skin. Give me some skin. Lay it on me. Yeah, Holmes. Beaming. People still say Holmes. I don't know. I, I don't Tom, think, it, the great thief, the ham thief. I don't think anybody says Holmes anymore. All right. Well, what is he got? What is that? A little? Is this just a it statue of I think a, it's a griffin? A, I think it's a Pokemon. <laughs> it's like a horse griffin. When you inquire oh, further about the scepter, uh, a hippogriff? Oh, yeah. Is that what a horse griffin is? It's a hippogriff, right? I, fucking like Buckbeak. Nope. Listen, nope. Look at me making Harry Dead. Potter references. Yep. Damn. Okay. I, can't, I pulled that one right out of my cleavage. Ooh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> uh, all right. So, fucking sewer levels. You cannot capture a target swimming underwater. Get that fucking fish. Wait. Oh, you gotta wait for your quarry to surface. Apparently, I don't know. I figure you've got like hell magics, so yeah, you probably right? shoot a fish that's underwater. If that's your magic doesn't work underwater, it's kind of the worst. Maybe magic. that's the maybe that's the weakness Is of this, this magic. Oh, okay, do we kill them all? Ah, fuck! Ah, fuck! Yeah, motherfucker! Nice. Oh, uh, that's our dude. I am hogging all these apples. Uh, I, I, this don't, apple. I don't care. No, meat. have at it, man. Do it. And a pear and another apple. I don't think you can trust apples that you find in the sewer inside of a fish. Come on. You've never had a sewer apple? No. Okay. The What's the pomegranate of the sewer? <laughs> okay. I don't think I'm interested in whatever. <laughs> I'm just going to say right now of that the sewer? whatever the highest quality merchandise that the sewer is able to produce not i'm not super interested in it i'm not you know i could probably find something that's not that well you're missing out because there is an entire ecosystem of delicious eating down there you never saw that guy fieri we're going to shit town i'm gonna take you straight to shit town no jason i've never watched <laughs> guy fieri do anything in my entire life there's I, this he's got a sewer episode okay. it only aired once okay where he said <laughs> Here's how you get the most delicious, delicious food uh -huh. in your local sewer. Okay. Look at that little floater right there. You grab that, you put some oregano on it, bam, we're in flavor town. Right. I've actually never heard Guy Fieri speak, yeah, but is I'm that, assuming that's that what sounds like. That sounds like Emerald. Uh, is it, you, I don't, got, you got a band Oh, I bammed. I bammed. Yeah. That's, that's not a Guy Fieri thing. That's true. He's yeah. the one with the blonde hair, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, he, he, oh, what the fuck? What was that? Okay, I don't know what happened. Guy Fieri's kind of like internet pu uh, internet punching bag. He's yeah. one of those guys who kind of fell afoul, ran afoul of uh, the internets. Yeah, I actually watched a stand-up comic do a pretty 
a pretty good set about like why the fuck you people like hate Guy Fieri so much? Like, what did he never do to you outside of just like have a show that people, some people liked watching? Yeah. Like, uh, Here, yeah, he's like, I, you know what? Oh, I here, imagine, grab. I imagine that watching whatever his show is. Yeah, and no, just hold still. Just, just, what? What yeah, am I? Eat that sausage. Eat what? That, I just eat that pretzel. Okay. Just by standing still? Well, when you pick up when you pick up food, you don't start eating it unless you stand still. Oh. So. All right. Um, yeah. Well, yeah. What has Guy Fieri done aside from say, "Hey, here's some delicious shit to eat when you're high." Yeah. Yep. I mean, like, look at Paula Dean. <laughs> yeah. Guy Fieri's She's never like, put a bunch of butter on it or something, and it's awesome. Well, also, like, I'm like, you know, well, thank you. Kind of slavery and stuff, but you know, whatever. Oh yeah, well, uh, you know, uh, she did make some. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. So like, okay, yeah, Paula Dean, not the best example. What I'm saying, no, what I'm saying is that like Guy Fieri, to my knowledge, has never. Like dropped an end bomb. Dropped the end bomb in private that we know of. Uh, I don't know. So yeah, he might be kind of. He might kind of look like a douche. I agree that he probably he does look like a douchebag. He looks really funny. He's a funny looking motherfucker. But like, Man. I've never watched his show. I don't know what has he done that's so fucking terrible. I don't know. Uh, What's up with me being all forgiving? I don't on this episode. That's a good question. Who? Are, wait. Are you Guy Fieri? Did you put on a Jason? <laughs> Where's Jason? <laughs> I'm going to pull my mask off. It's any me, second now. Guy Fieri. This is, I sound like a vampire. <laughs> well, yeah, why is he Dracula <laughs> now? Uh, maybe like, maybe Guy Fieri is a Dracula. Maybe he's a Who's Dracula. Who's to say? That's why, that's why he looks so crazy. Is he's trying to hide his identity so you don't figure out that he used to be Vlad the the Butterman or whatever. I don't know what Guy Fieri's cooking thing is, like hot wings or something or... Uh, yeah, Jason. he does like. Uh, this is this is hairy, dude. Get I don't know if you noticed, but we're in a little bit of a pickle here. Yeah, we just gotta kill this. God damn, dude. Okay, trick another potion. Yeah. Uh, yeah. First, I'm making excuses for Rob Liefeld, and then Guy yeah, Fieri. Fieri. Yeah. What's going on? What's next, Juggalos? <laughs> uh, I I I have. <laughs> I have. Oh no. <laughs> I have my uh, my standards, Jeff. Okay, okay. all right. No, this is still very much Jason you're talking <laughs> okay, to. Okay, good. I'm almost dead. Uh, did you use all your potions? There we, we go. Potions. Now I have used all my potions. Okay. That's all right. We are almost got through the boss. Uh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Just use your, use your powers. I, I'm just trying oh, to charge them back up. Shit. I'm almost dead, too. Fuck. Uh, oh, shit. Okay. Oh, fuck. Go! Did you die? No, no, we beat him. Oh, good. We, just, we won. I so. was almost dead. Woo! All right, that's uh, Dragon's Crown Pro. We're going to be back tomorrow. We're going to do some more. We got the scepter. We got some B rank treasure. Hopefully, it'll give you something. We caught the hand bandit. We got the hand bandit. Yep. Um, thanks everybody for watching. Patreon.com forward slash rage select. Uh, hit the like and subscribe button. Hit the, hit the, the bell. Whatever that does anymore. I don't know. Um, yeah. Uh, the belt. <laughs> what, hit, hit all the YouTube things. Just hit every button on YouTube, uh, and then also go check out the Modern Rogue on Fridays. What did you do, that guys? Do last week? Quarterstaff fighting, or uh, oh yeah, the one. That, well, yeah, quarterstaff fighting. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It was it was cool until I got hit in the balls. Oh shit! So watch that. If I you have to watch that <laughs> shot in Freud at its <laughs> finest. If you want to see me get smacked in the bits? I do want to see you get smacked. In I the can't bits. blame you. Well. Come back tomorrow and somebody is going to get smacked the bits we're gonna play more dragon's crown we'll see you then